All right, I'm at KWM factory in Rockdale, Illinois, and a professional certified technician is gonna switch this machine from 6K to 7K. Here we go. He's gonna do the box assembly. Is that correct? Yep. Box assembly? Yep, the lip box assembly. Lip box assembly. Here we go. He's gonna loosen it up. Oh, I like how it has a lot of space here. That's good. Yep. He's gonna lift that into position and tighten it back down. I love his tools. He's got a little automatic ratchet. That's very, very handy. Half inch. Yep. Beautiful. And the tech name is Scott. Scott. One of the lead technicians here, making sure the gutter is running good. So he checked the 6K, it's good. So Scott's gonna change it to 7K. And he's gonna double check, make sure everything rolls. He puts that away. And that's the second part of the, the box lip assembly is the bar. Yep. I guess it's called the bar. So you got a six inch bar and a seven inch bar. And before I know it, he already lifted those things and he's dropping those yep. so right. fast. He dropped them so fast that I couldn't even, that's professional. And he's tightening the red bolts only. Two bolts holding the bar for the seven inch gutter. And he's gonna hand tighten, nothing too, nothing too hard. There it is. And what else we got? So I'll take out the back side of the building. He is. And then just pop oh. that guy out of the way. Oh, so that's what you use. You use a super long uh, ratchet. With an extension, yep. Yeah, look at that. Pop that guy out. So that's. Put that to the side. That's what you need. I mean, you could do it from here if yeah. you move the guillotine. You and just decide to do it more uh, intriguing way. Just run down, make sure all your skate bearings are out. Skate bearings. Please he's guys. moving them out. And he's moving guide the guide bar, gets pushed back. And the skate bearings get pushed out, just like so. We're gonna watch it right here. It's very comfortable to have the machine up on the stand like this. Yeah. So it makes it really... This uh, machine is 6.7 combo. It's 13.4 uh, inches long. There you go. And I think Scott has it. He's adjusted it. There you go. He's moving the bar out. Moving the bar. And it's good. The bar is out. And I think he's already set the guides here. And he's got a 7-inch gallon guillotine right there. So You're at three and a half minutes, brother. Man. We might have to re rewrite the manual. <laughs> KWM is uh, just up their game in terms of how easy it is to switch the machine from one profile to the next. Yep. There it goes. And it helps to have access here, of course. Mm -hmm. If you don't have access for those two bolts, you would have to just reach in. Yep, just reach in and then uh, yeah. on out. Without the guillotine, of course, but yeah. Very nice. And he's just flipping it over. Uncut video, how Scott puts everything back together. There it goes. All right. So the last thing is the guillotine and the bead assembly. Yep, and then I'll just have to mark the bead assembly.
There it is. And his long extension. And that's it. I really like how the guillotine holds on the two support screws. Yeah, it makes it a lot easier. Man, because otherwise you got to hold it and fight. And so, gets lifted out, goes in the stand, and... There you go, you got a factory notch right there. Just happened right at the factory. Just setting the, uh... is this a marker or not non-marking? No, this one's the non-marker. Okay, perfect, it's all set. Yep, and that's it. And then I would have to put on the other guillotine mount. Beautiful. So, you know, six and a half minutes. Yep. Scott did it. KWM certified technician, six and a half minutes. Let's see if you can beat that.